Rhapsody of Realities Daily Devotional Saturday the 24th of February by Pastor Chris The topic, A Witness to Your Generation Our first verse And we are his witnesses of these things And so is also the Holy Ghost Whom God hath given to them that obey him Acts 5.32 did you know that God expects your friends and colleagues, co-workers, business associates, schoolmates, family members, co-tenants and all those he ever connects you with who aren't yet born again will get to hear the gospel through you for their salvation? They're all hanging on to the trust committed to you by God. He holds you responsible as their witness. You are the witness to your generation. Therefore be committed to bringing salvation to those in your world. That's where your fulfilment in life lies. You become a fruit-producing branch, fulfilling what Jesus said in John 15:5, I am the vine, ye are the branches. You are a fruit-bearing branch, bearing fruits of righteousness and manifesting works of righteousness. You carry the seeds of the kingdom inside you. That's your number one ministry in life. Remember the words of Jesus, But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Matthew 6, 33 Make the expansion of his kingdom in the earth your priority, and his glory will be manifested in and through you. You have to come to the realization that the gospel, the same message that saved your life, has been committed to your trust. Paul knew it. Hence he declared in 1 Timothy 1.11, According to the glorious gospel of the blessed God, which was committed to my trust. Take personal responsibility for the gospel, and you'll live an absolutely fulfilling and impactful life. Let's say this prayer together. Father, thank you for the blessing of being counted faithful to be a minister of reconciliation. Thank you for your glorious gospel, which has been committed to my trust. I'll keep preaching it boldly everywhere. I'll keep preaching it boldly everywhere and to everyone. until the whole earth is filled with the knowledge of your glory. And your salvation and righteousness reign upon the nations. In Jesus' name, Amen.